we all know what Trump's up to today. You know, when he gets that eight minutes, he's going to now announce it's a big national emergency. I have to build that wall. Uh, so nonsense. So I wanted to do a reading to see just how this is going to go over with the general populace. How many can he snow with this? Okay. He knows he's got to do this now before because people are starting to lose their paychecks. And he can crow all he wants to that the people are behind him with this. But, uh, yeah, no. They start losing their paychecks. They want to put food on their table. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, he's going to try to strong arm it. Okay, he's going to try to strong arm things. It's exactly what he's up to tonight. You know, dark money. He's got some deal on the side that he's going to make money from this. So that's what he's pushing. He's about his money. He's not about anybody else's money. Okay. Oh, I'm going to bring back the, the good times. Is that what he's going to talk about? We need to go back to a safer time. It's not safe anymore. Okay, people are taking their lumps and their bumps. He's going to talk about, again, this need for security. Look at the world. Look what's happening. Oh, my God, it's so sad. We need to put an end to this. Okay, but make no mistake. He's got people behind him like, uh, like Mercer. Yeah, karma card. Karma's going to come up and smack him for this. Okay, karma's going to come up and smack him for this. So we know what his plan is. He's got some big money deal behind it. So that's all he cares about is money. Okay, that's all he cares about. And something he can crow that he actually did. Okay. I wonder how he's going to enjoy that sitting in jail. Okay. Nonsense. So let's look at here. Let's look at the people that are listening to this tonight. What's going to be the take of the people that are tuning into this tonight? The Trump supporters. Are they going to be supportive of this or are they... Uh, going to finally say enough is enough of this rhetoric and nonsense. What's going to happen with the Trump supporters? Trump supporters see that he's coming out in strength, carrying a big stick. Maybe that he's looking forward. And this, I don't know why the Queen of Wands is coming up. Maybe this is the opposition to things, you know. And, uh, you know, there's a lot of heartbreak surrounding it. A lot of heartbreak. People are taking their lumps. They know that pretty soon they're going to be out in the cold. You know. They're losing money. They're not, you know, and looking at Trump's drama, okay, that they see that he's coming in with this big, huge thing, but he's, again, um, out for himself. And they're tight on money. They're trying to cling to every penny they have, okay? They feel like he's, you know, micromanaging stuff and that they're beggars at this point with the way things are going. They want to see some kind of temperance. They want to see, they're not thrilled with him. They feel like maybe he's walking off a cliff with this. Yeah, they want to get back to sunnier times. They want to get back to better things. They want him to walk away from this crap. Yeah, they want him to walk away from it. You know, but he's charging forward and they're getting offered something they don't want. They just want to go back to a better time. They don't want to see it. They don't want to hear it anymore because this, while it's a burden to be carried, 
they don't like the strong arm tactics, okay? They want to heal it. They want to have better things, but they're really disappointed in the way things are coming forward. You know, they just want their ship to come in. They want, you know, they want things done right. This is, yes, it's a big emotional issue, but they want justice. They want, in the end, they want justice. Okay. So, yeah, when it comes to affecting their paychecks and the other things, they're, uh, you know, we're all for strong borders and everything, but we need our money. This is nonsense. This is nonsense. They're not going to be buying it so easily anymore. So it looks like some of his base are going to start turning when it, is, it affects their paychecks and things for him just to, uh, again get his way throwing his tantrum uh yeah this is not gonna fly so well okay so we're looking at uh it's gonna backfire i think on him by trying to uh say this is a federal emergency okay so i'm gonna leave this here we'll see if the cards are right or wrong and watched him make his big speech tonight with all lies and drama, you know. I think that's the worst part, that he just 100% lies, makes up stuff. And he's got uh, Kellyanne Conway, he's got uh, Huckabee Sanders out there lying through their teeth. Pence is lying through his teeth. And it's just absolutely ridiculous but uh again maybe this is what it it takes this drastic of an action of people actually losing their paychecks looking at their you know thing to say okay enough is enough on this okay they're going to be looking for something better than trumpism come in the elections coming up that's for sure they want somebody coming in that's not going to make a fake shutdown to the government so they lose their money.